to repossess sod that has not been paid for by the customer or would-be customer we have pulled off of the job because she verbally assaulted verbally berated all six of us I made the decision to pull off of the job we had to go empty the truck and we're coming back to pull the sod off of the public access which is the sidewalk as I said she has not paid for any of the sod so I am retrieving my paid for product you can see it is on the sidewalk to get out and go grab it. Let's just start piling you know, about halfway line. Alright, let's just see what the shots are talking
So anyways, you can clearly see how deep I'm able to go down with a weed eater. It is to the top of my, it's the top of my toe. That's a couple of inches. And anybody that's in landscape knows or should know that you never completely level out the new sod install. Like you can see it's not even an inch above the existing sod, okay? Not even an inch above it. Why do you not put it perfectly level? Because sod settles, that's why you don't do that. So she comes out here, yells and goes off. We came out here to trim hedges, trim things up for her, um, install sod, put mulch down. She comes out, starts going off on me, telling me I don't know what I'm doing. That's not how you do sod work. I had to gently and politely explain to her that I've done nearly 600 pallets of sod in the last few years that I understand what I'm doing and I'm having you know to sit here and defend myself and um, yeah it just went crazy from there went off on the guys and uh, yeah we came back and we got the sod sorry the camera timed out but the reason I'm still filming is because I want to make it obvious we just pulled up the sod there's nobody here nobody coming out she did pull out earlier didn't say anything and so we're getting in the truck and we're leaving oh, oh. how was that that was fantastical.